But yesterday I floated the idea of Hoppy coming in and taking over for. Uh, oh, I heard. For Spanish. <laughs> I don't know what How I don't know. I don't know what I got more direct messages about you saying BS about Hoppy or you talking about your dreams and nobody stopping you. <laughs> Not only did nobody so saw many me, people, we everybody chimed in. in. Yeah. They loved it. Yeah. So Dream you, Talk was number uh, one. Maybe number one in the room, yep. not number one on air. Right. People are like, good grief, get back there and stop him. He's talking about, he goes, when you're not there, it turns into Mike's chit chat about his dreams. Yep. 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 I had a lot to talk about yesterday. We asked a lot of questions. We started talking about mental health. And yep. all kinds yeah. of weird Galvin, stuff. I've been dreaming a lot about high school. Uh, by the way, back to your other thing, uh, you were curious Just about. like I didn't even say anything. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Uh, you were curious about how I would react if I came in and Hoppy was here. I wouldn't come in. It wouldn't. Well, happen. no, no, but you wouldn't know I, until you got. I here. had my prediction. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you would leave. Walk there. He was going to have him here. You were going to walk and go. Nope. Yeah, hundred yeah. percent. Yep, hundred <laughs> percent. And I agree with that hundred percent too. Yeah. There was no. He would have walked right in and went no, and turned around and just walked yeah. out. It wouldn't even a nope. Would have been a no. Yeah. Yep. No. Yeah. Well, he never called back. So yeah. mm. I think we're okay. I think you're safe there. Yeah. Thank you. Mark safe. <laughs> safe from but you Hoppy. weren't here for the discussion. No. It, it doesn't matter. No, 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 no. If we were to put somebody in uh, in that place, who would your number one choice be? Uh, my number one choice is already here. In- Empty. No, I know. Oh. I said if we were. If we had to. to. Yeah, yeah. If we had to put somebody in there. I have enjoyed Carmen being here the last. Yeah, well, days. certainly, I think that's my number one choice is definitely to have Carmen here and then somebody running the board back there. And who that somebody running the board back there is, uh, I you know, Dizzy's always fun to have in there. Yeah, uh, I don't know whether that's something Will would be interested in. Mm-hmm. Uh, Will's another good Will, person. Uh, then Will's going to want his name on the show. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> it's, well, we got to let him know that up front. The Mike Count the Show with Will <laughs> featuring <laughs> Will Coons. Featuring Will Coons. Well, yeah. listen, if Will's getting featuring, I'm getting. Co-host, <laughs> uh, co-hosted by and we just list everybody there. Yeah. It's a very cumbersome Produced name. Produced by, uh-huh. yeah, yeah. Well, we could uh, run closing credits if that'll make everybody happy. Yeah. I don't care. About Carmen's that. wardrobe provided by. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Look, I'm in. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Carmen's yeah. breakfast provided by. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's the way to go. The spade and New Year's Gringo. <laughs> yeah, Frankie's Chop House. Mm, mm, mm. Uh, who man. were who were some of your thoughts? I don't. I don't think I. The I bench is not very deep. No. Yeah. I mean, I. I said the hobby thing as a joke, um, because Mike Olivero still talks to Hoppy, which makes me laugh. Uh, I'm not mad at Hoppy. So Hoppy thinks that I'm mad at him because he left and took a job at iHeart that he then got fired from and then went to Beasley. And I think he thinks I'm mad at him because of that I couldn't care less. Do whatever you have to do. He's just talked so much garbage about me on social media that people keep sending me. I don't follow him. I don't know what he does, but people keep sending me all these videos. He's making talking trash about me. Like I did something to him. I didn't do anything. I mean, I, I bought that kid clothes, shoes. I I've given him money for stuff. I made sure he went on the cruise. Like, I don't really know what I have a question. Yeah. Why do you care? No, I don't care. I but don't you do because but I'm not you talk sleep about over it. it. Well, I do a talk show. Uh, but uh, I don't, I definitely don't, I'm not losing sleep over it, but it is, I am curious to see, because it's not just him, Galvin, it's the people like that, that are, that, uh, like, you know, Spanish will end up the same way. Like Spanish, well, yeah, I just know will be hands. the next one. But to, has he really? It, it, I mean, but like, like, I don't know that he's not going to be, uh, oh, that's true that we've heard some things that he said. Right. Since, so uh, maybe yeah. not like straight up outright, but no. And he says leaning. things that are ridiculously untrue too. About what he thinks I can control and what I can and what I can't, and uh, I mean, it's true that he really started to believe the whole narrative that I run everything around here. Which, if it was true, we'd be on, we'd be working a lot less. Yeah, we'd be on three, yeah, three but day I, work week. My whole thing is, I don't even know why you give any weight to it. It's like it's one of those things where it's like, who cares about? It's not people. a matter of caring about now. It's like it, I care more about why did I ever bother. You know what I'm saying? That's what bothers me. Why did I? Why did I give so much time? Why did I care? Why was I nice in the first place? Oh, when you only know it's going to end up like this anyway. Yeah, yeah. that's why I'm always mean. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, I it's, know what I'm doing. Yeah, yeah. It makes that's sense. It makes but see, it, that there is a difference, though. I look at it from I don't see it's on you because you there what you didn't do anything. So what changed in their life in his life to make him blame you? 
You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, because nobody wants to take the blame for stuff. Exactly. No one wants to take responsibility for do their you own know, actions. Do you know how many times I've done this where uh, I either cut somebody off in traffic or did something and I give them the, that was me. Yeah. My yeah, dad. Yeah. You got it. You got to own it. Yeah. You make a mistake, own it and go, yeah, um, you know, and then if they keep going, you go, all right, I already said yeah. it was my fault. I was Relax. backing up the other day at a Target and I, uh, I looked up and there were two people right behind my car. And I rolled down my window and they looked at me like, what could you possibly have to say to us? You almost hit it. I didn't almost hit him, but, and I went, Hey, sorry, I didn't see you. And they were like, it's okay. Yeah. Everybody becomes all happy. Yeah, right. it was my that, bad. I didn't see it. And that's the thing. Most of the time, if you own up for something or yeah. if you're just pleasant to someone, they lose their attitude mm -hmm. so fast. Sure, They just want you to acknowledge you were wrong. Right. People like to be right. So yeah. if you say you were wrong, they go, yeah, you were wrong. All right. Oh, then or, Thanks. Or people just like to be acknowledged. Like sure. literally, like if you if you hold the door open, just say thanks or hey, thanks. You, like you know yeah. what I mean? Just say something. Give them a nod. Acknowledge the person that held the door. Like it didn't just automatically open for you. I love whenever I say hi to people or how you doing or anything like that, and they just put their head down or whatever, and I go, Good, fantastic, <laughs> good to hear it. And then I trip them as they're walking by. Wait, uh, <laughs> um this is never gonna happen and it's a it's but it would be pretty interesting. Is if if we sat on the show, like if we hired somebody to be on the show now, they have to sign an agreement that at the end of their work here, whether it be by uh, them quitting or getting fired or whatever, they have to have an exit interview on the air. Mm. That would be, oh. so, wouldn't that be so yeah. great? Yeah. I got to tell you something. <laughs> Geo, are you ready for that? Yeah. 